the first uh, general error is uh, your signal is wrong so if you're turning right you want to have your right signal on and if you're turning left then you want to have your left signal on so in this example I'm turning right so I have my right signal on now the second uh, general mistake is your signal is missing so you're turning left or right and you forgot to put the signal on the third uh, general mistake is uh, your your signal is uh, too late or it's too soon now technically your signal should be on about 30 meters before the intersection you want to turn on if your signal is too late or too soon that's going to be a general mistake the next general error is your signal is on through an intersection so you're you're signaling through intersection uh, so what i mean by that is in this example now we have this back lane here so let's say you want to turn right on this next intersection but your signal should be on after this back lane if you put the signal on right now it's misleading because people might think you're turning right into the back lane here and that's going to be a general mistake so that's where after the back lane that's when you put the signal on uh, to turn right on this intersection the next uh, general mistake is um, missing shoulder check so before your right turns uh, now you have to uh, when the line breaks you have to go in the bicycle lane and before you go in the bicycle lane you have to do shoulder check to make sure there's no cyclist in the bicycle lane so for example here I'm going to turn right now before I come into this bicycle lane see here the line breaks now when the line breaks I'm going to come in the bicycle lane but before I do that I have to put the right signal on and then I have to do right shoulder check to make sure there's no cyclist in the bicycle lane the next uh, general error is uh, you're changing lane um, too soon so you're going over a solid line so if you look in this example here we are going to turn right at the traffic light like right now the lines are solid line that means I should not be changing lane but when the line breaks so now we see a broken white line here that's when I do right shoulder check uh, to make sure there's no cyclist and that's when I change lane to the right side so if I'm changing lane over a solid um, white line that's gonna be a general mistake the next uh, general mistake is uh, you're too far from the curb so now you came in the bicycle lane so here I'm coming in the bicycle lane and I have to stay closer to the curb before I turn so uh, within three feet so if you check the right side of my car and the distance from the right side of the car to the curb it has to be within three feet if I am too far from the curb uh, that's gonna be a general mistake it could be a critical error it just depends on the situation but um, if the if you're not interfering with anyone when you're too far um, then it's a general mistake but if you start interfering with other traffic like let's say maybe the cars in this lane here uh, or um, maybe there was a cyclist in the bicycle lane then it becomes a critical error so as you can see here I'm turning right and I was staying within three feet uh, from the curb all right uh, so let's look at the critical errors now the first uh, critical error is you are going in a bicycle bicycle lane when you should not be so for example in this uh, right turn here if you notice the line here is a solid white line that means I should not go in the bicycle lane so solid white line means I have to go in the next available lane but if you notice a broken white line here that's when you go in the bicycle lane first and then you change your lane so in this example I am just turning right in the next uh, next available lane because the line was a solid white line if I go in the bicycle lane here that's gonna be a critical error in the driving test the next uh, critical error is uh, if I start turning from the second lane for example let's say here we are going to turn right at the traffic light now 
I have to when the line breaks by the rules I should uh, go in the bicycle lane and then in this uh, far lane closer to the curb to uh, complete my right turn if I start turning right from this lane here that's gonna be a critical error so here I'm I have my signal on I'm doing shoulder check I go in the lane that's closer to the curb uh, light is red so I make a full stop here and when it's safe or when the light turns green um, that's when I complete my turn so here we have another example, uh, I'm going to turn right so I have to go in the bicycle lane when the line breaks. If I don't do that, um, that's going to be critical error then. So if I start turning right from this lane here instead of going in the bicycle lane, um, that's, that's going to be a critical error. The next critical error, uh, we kind of already cover that here uh, when you're changing lane here you're interfering with the cyclist or uh, maybe you're changing lane too late and there was already a car in the bicycle lane. So in this example here when I'm changing lane now there is a cyclist but the cyclist was actually too far so that means it was safe for me to uh, change lane. So as you can see the cyclist is still quite far uh, from my car so that was a good time for me to change lane. So if you start interfering with, uh, with a cyclist or maybe uh, when you're moving over to the bicycle lane uh, you were doing it too late, uh, there was already a car in the bicycle lane and you did not see that car um, so that's going to be a critical error. Alright, uh, so that's it for this video. Uh, these are the most common general and critical errors in uh, bicycle lane.